my question is, uh, after, Melissa, after you performed your original song about Brangelina on Watch What Happens Live, <laughs> did you ever hear from them, and would you perform it on tour? <laughs> it was a great song. You wrote it so fast. Did I, you hear from either of them after that? No. You didn't. I Nobody. did, actually. I heard from both of them. You did not. <laughs> I heard from Angelina, and she's like, you bitch. I was like, it's not me. It's Melissa <laughs> No, it was it was it was really tense there for I know it for was. a day. We because it was I mean you know getting kind of threatened and yeah and no, it all just poof went away. Good. Good. Is good. This yeah. is like a meeting of the Angelina Jolie fan club here. You know what? I for, I, I'm upset that I was so upset with Angelina Jolie. I realize she's probably just trying to do her best, too. You know, I mean, obviously, I'm not going to hang out with her, but I, I, I get it now. Like, I have more sympathy and empathy for people that are like, she's really a mom and a wife and whatever she is. I'm not sure. But uh, good luck to her. <laughs> uh, Molly C. wants to know, Melissa, besides David Crosby, what did you consider other famous people for a sperm donor? Yeah, well, uh, Brad was considered. He was, he was a very good friend of mine. And um, then it, that just seemed, like, really complicated. Right. Like, like super complicated. I wonder why. <laughs> <laughs> Liz, my children are like, I could have had Brad Pitt as a father. I, <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, let's go to John.